if you are having crashes and freezing in fortnite after this brand new update so guys today in this video i'm gonna show you how to fix any kind of crashes in fortnite on your any pc so guys welcome to my channel make sure to watch this whole video if you want to fix the crashes problem on your pc so with wasting any time let's dive straight into over this video so guys for that go for your windows search and now simply search for temp and here you will find out delete temporary files so go for the settings now you will find out here this temporary file folder where we have 98 gb of the temporary data on our pc and this is also causing the crashes so now select all the folders from here and guys simply uncheck this downloaded folder because this can have some important data which you have downloaded on your pc now click on this remove file button hit continue and delete all this junk data from your pc now in the next step you need to download fix fortnite all crashes pack on your pc link available down in the description simply open up the link that will take you onto my this official website from where you will find out here the latest article about how to fix crashes in fortnite simply open up that article and download this pack on your pc inside you will find out all these files simply select all these files and drag it here on your desktop so guys here we got all these files on our desktop so in the very first step you need to open up the txt file that is fix windows file open up this txt file and now you need to simply copy this command from here and this will fix all the corrupted data or corrupted file of your windows so now you need to open up the cmd so go for your window search search for cmd and run this as administrator now hit yes now simply paste here this command and press enter so guys here the operation is started now you can check out here beginning verification phase of system scan and verification will take few time to scanning all the files from your windows and this will automatically fix all the corrupted files so guys once the scanning is complete here you can check out here window resource protection did not find any integrity violations so guys now we are good to go for the next step and guys this is completely fine now simply close out of the cmd now for the next step you need to open up this directx 11 folder because if you have any corrupted file of your directx 11 installed on your pc that will also cause the crashing while you play any game on your pc so guys for that you need to simply scroll all the way down and find out here this dxsetup.exe file double tap here hit yes click i accept the agreement click next next again and now it will ask you for downloading and installing the netframe 2.0 on your pc so click on this download button this will start searching for the required file and download this required software on your pc so guys once the required file has been downloaded on your pc now here you can check it out here simply close out of this window and now our installation is also completed for our directx 11 so guys click on this finish button and now simply close out of this folder now let's go for the next step that is the visual see one time all in one package so guys open up this folder and inside you'll find out here this all visual c one time redistribution pack so you need to go for this install all the bad file and this will install all these packs on your pc and if any of this is missing on your pc that will also cause the crashing so guys therefore go for this install all the bad file right click here and make sure on this as administrator now hit yes now you just need to wait and this will automatically install all these files on your pc and this will 100 percent fix any kind of crashes or freezing in fortnite so guys just wait a bit for installing all these packages on your pc so once the installation is complete now you simply again close out of this folder now in the final and the last step of this optimization pack here you will find out gear up booster so open up this txt file and now here you will find out this kind of the search this kind of the address so guys simply copy this link from here go for your browser and guys hit enter and paste here this address click on this download for window and download gear up booster on your pc after installation here you will find out this kind of the interface of the gear up booster and guys you can simply log in here your account using your email your google id or your facebook id so now you need to go for your fortnite or whatever game in which you want to optimize your ping you can go for the games tab and here you will find a thousand of the game so you need to go for your home tab and you will find out the install game automatically now click on this boost button and guys this will start optimizing the network for you with the best routing so guys once you are connected with the gear up booster here you will find out this kind of the region and guys here kind of the node so this will guys automatically find everything for you you do not have to change anything from here so guys click on this launch game button and guys make sure to launch your game after launching the gear up booster 
So guys here once you have launched the fortnite on your pc now you need to open up your gear booster and here you can check out here your estimated thing and guys every single thing now here is the routing detail you can check out here my pc that is connected with the gear booster and then gear booster is connected with the dubai server and then here it is the adaptive intelligent routing that is automatically find out the best ping for you and optimize your route for getting the best performance for the network so guys once you have installed the optimization pack on your pc for fixing the crashing in fortnite now let's go for the optimization of our fortnite so guys for that you need to open up the epic games launcher first of all and go for the library and find out here your fortnite so go for the three doors now go for options and now from here you need to follow these settings first of all uncheck high resolution textures from here uncheck this box this will also save your 15 gb of the data on your hard drive now next here you will find a directx 12 shader if you are using if you are using the directx 12 so guys check mark here otherwise simply uncheck this box from here now here is the most important that is the pre-download steam asset guys make sure to download this pre-download steam assets on your pc so simply check mark on this box and download pre-download steam asset on your pc after that now click on this apply button now in the next step you need to go for this profile icon simply click here and open up the settings after doing it now scroll all the way down and here you will find out fortnite so click on this drop down check mark onto the additional command line argument and now simply use here the same exact command also inside your epic games launcher so guys simply type minus or type youth all available course after typing here this command this will guys allow your cpu to use the maximum performance of your cpu cores for the fortnite so now in the final and the last step we are going to disable fso on our windows so guys for that you need to go for your file explorer now go for for this pc open up your c drive where you install your fortnite now go for program file epic games fortnite folder fortnite game bind wreath win64 now go for ev anti cheat double tap here and here you will find out ev anti cheat so guys right click here go for run as administrator and hit yes once you have done it this will guys automatically reinstall the ev anti cheat on your pc and this will also fix a lot of your crashes there and this will fix out most of your crashes in fortnite so guys after doing it now simply close out of this window now you have to simply one time restore your pc therefore all it should take effect after that launch your fortnite and enjoy the fortnite without having any crashes or freezing so guys that's it for this video and guys i will see you in the next video